Good evening. Um, it looks like daytime outside, but it's, that's the lights of Blue Car Park. Um, welcome to my channel, Ollie JHN, and today we're here on YouTube. Um, and I have someone again. He's, he's appeared in my car. He was so desperate to get back on the oh, channel, Dan. Yeah, so, uh, that's, that's basically why I'm here. Yeah, exactly. Um, it's all those, and he's, all he's, those Instagram lights. Yeah. <laughs> he's so busy at the moment. Um, I can't even get him, so I've managed to grab him today and we're filming all the videos at once. We've done the car. Yeah, he's exploiting me for all my uses. Yes, so <laughs> I've done. he's been a cameraman for my car video, um, not those sort of uses, and <laughs> now we are doing this beautiful scenery. Yeah, well, I'm Tarmac. Good. Yeah, and this is our theme. We're going to be talking about positivity because today, the day we're filming this, which is the, the day, 7th of the October, 7th October today, Friday the 7th, it's National Happiness Day, yes. Well, no, it's or National, Smile Day. National Smile National Day. Smile, I don't even know what that is, but it's National Smile Day. And if smile. any of you know Ollie in, li in life, or have known Ollie in life, you'll know what he's known for, and that's why we're doing this talk. Yes, yeah, so we're going to be talking about positivity, how to stay positive in every single situation. Let's start with... Um, You've got to accept in life that you're going to be put in many situations from stressful, you're going to be angry, you're going to be happy, you're going to be sad, you're going to be up and down. But the main thing is to expect that because if you don't, it's going to be a shock when it comes. Is that, yeah. that yeah. fair to yeah. say? Expect that you're going to be down sometimes and try and think of a way to combat that. So sometimes, um, maybe I've said this before, but a smile can be seen as a shield. It can be put up as something almost to hide what you're truly feeling. You could be quite depressed or sad and you could be smiling because you want to try and see a positive spin on things. So, Dan, what's your... I think, I think exactly taking? what you said. Like, okay. people put on... People that I've known put on um, smiles because they... All they want to do is they want to make people around them feel good. Yes. Um, I think it's very important in a world where there's not a lot of positivity, especially in media. Exactly. So yeah. whenever you watch Turn on the News, the only time you're really going to see positivity is around the Olympics. Exactly. Around, yeah, big events like that. Um, I would say the World Cup, but England in the World Cup, it's a bit contentious. Mm, yeah, Let's not, not go England. there. Um, <laughs> 1966. Um, <laughs> yeah. This is just after this car was... I know. It was, yeah. <laughs> just before, even. Yeah, just before. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, but so I think media and technology are definitely something that's putting an influence on our positivity. It's something that can really spread quickly and put a negative spin on something that perhaps was just normal and it really throws it up, fires it up. Yeah. Something that's put on social media meaning one thing and it can get taken the wrong way, escalated and chucked out. of Even, main, yeah. even mainstream media. It's important to see past um, the layers and layers and layers that mainstream media put on things. So you'll hear yes. something on the BBC, for example, and you'll hear something on ITV. It'll be complete. Yeah, exactly. There's two same stories taken from two different angles, but they're both negative. Yes. But they're just negative in different ways. Exactly, yeah. Everyone has different opinions, and therefore people have different views on things, and it, it completely changes sometimes of what people think. And at this point, I just want to quickly say that we're not slagging off media, because media can have very positive effects yeah, on the bad stuff. I just want to quickly mention a, a little clip actually I saw today on bullying, which was on this morning. So if you have a chance to check out this morning's Facebook page, then check it out. It's something that really puts a perspective on bullying and it's something that I definitely encourage you to watch. I think it's important that if you ever get a chance, you bog down in school work or bog down in uni work or bog down in work, in any work, try and look up a spoken word, um, Stuff. There's a guy called Prince E A. I think it is. Okay, I'll put that in my description. Put that in, he'll yeah. put it in the description. It's um, he does really good talks on education and one talk that we'll probably do in the future about education. Yes, that's, um, that's to come. Yeah, yeah. And it's really it really puts a different perspective. Like I watched a five minute one yesterday, and it just really put into perspective what what we take for granted and exactly you know, what yes. school is and how school is not for everyone and all that. Yes. So. I think it's important that if I was to give one tip about yep. staying positive, if you can make everyone around you feel positive, then you automatically will feel positive because and you've, got, posi you've yeah. got positive people around you. If you aim in your life to be positive for others, that's what I try to do. I try to be positive for definitely, others. Yeah. Even if you're pessimistic about yourself, which I am most definitely, 
the people around you will make you feel positive because you have the, very, yeah. very positive people because you've helped them. Then become positive. Yeah, it's like even a if spread, they're not. Yeah. yeah. So if you are ever feeling negative or anything like that, I think one of the the main key things and a tip here really is to speak to someone. I know they always say it, but if that's a friend, if it's a family, if it's maybe an external source that you wouldn't feel embarrassed speaking to, um, it's just important that you do speak to someone because you don't want to bottle it up, so to speak. And yeah, I've, I've had experience on that. Dan's a very positive person, as he said. Well, that's well, what, as pos- I know. Positive for others. Positive for others, not himself. But um, that's definitely. why he needs other people to be positive for him. But that's how it works. It's a bit like a chain. It's hard to be positive for yourself but easier to be positive for others. It's it, it's it, most definitely. Self-belief is the hardest thing. People say yes. that it's impossible to in- achieve something if you don't have self-belief. But how are you supposed to get self-belief if you don't have self-confidence? And if you can't achieve something in the first place. Yeah, exactly. It's... If you, you need others to motivate you and then that motivation builds the self-confidence, builds the self-belief. Yes. And I am much more confident in myself because I've surrounded myself with positive people. Good, yeah. So it works. There we go. There's evidence for it. Um, obviously there's going to be separate topics that people feel negatively about so sometimes speaking to people is quite hard because they might not understand where you're coming from in the first place they might not have that same negative feel so sometimes talking to people can conflict so it's important you speak to the right people as well would you agree with that yeah I think it's important that you speak to someone that you trust yes because most most of the time people that you trust are the people that will give you the right guidance so I think Ollie will agree when we when we talk I don't always agree with him and i think no. he understands that it's because it's because i have his best interest yes. rather than I, i'm being positive for him. everything i say is positive for him but yes. i say it in a way that probably he doesn't expect he's still getting a positive outcome and he gives him something to think about because at the end of the day whatever he decides it's his decision it's no one else's so the only yes, thing exactly. i can do is just give what i my opinion is yeah it's like need for speed <laughs> it's like need for speed here tonight i blew <laughs> Uh, Fast and Furious 8 is being filmed as we speak. Um, <laughs> Blue, Water, Blue Water in Kent. Come here and enjoy it. Yeah. Publicity there for them. I wonder if they're paying us. Um, <laughs> need it. Need to pay. <laughs> I ain't got a drum. <laughs> uh, so there we go. Um, I've just Let's end on one thing. Let's end with this. There's two types of positivity. There's one where you're outside positive. It's maybe more of a negative side of positivity. It's something where you almost block everything. You try and see something as positive. Um, you know, you're always looking happy, but perhaps you're not happy. And then there's another type of positive where inside you're a very positive person. It rubs off on people. It's a very good type of positivity. You might not always be smiling, but inside, you know, you're positive for other people. So they are the two types of positivity. Um, try and be the second one, basically. Um, so that is the, um, the end of our video. Are you happy with that? Yeah, yeah. no, that's, yeah. That, I, think, I think it covers everything. Because... That does, yes. Um, yeah, so thank you very much for watching. If you did like this video, then give it a like. That's going to be floating over Dan again. Um, if you want to subscribe, then please do subscribe. You can click on my logo in the bottom right-hand corner and hover over that and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And um, free mouthwash here as well. You get this in the, uh, the cards. <laughs> and finally, if you want to comment, then please do comment below. That would be... Uh, appreciate it if you want to ask any questions. Um, so that is it. It is National Smile Day, is it today? National Smile National Day. World Smile Day. Uh, keep smiling, keep happy. Yeah, just keep a positive side to things. There's always a light at the end of the tunnel. Good night.